So what better way to top off the day than a trip to Columbus, Ohio to the German village. We are going to eat at Schmidt's Sausage House and Restaurant. Uh, now I have been here before, I did not film it. But today we are going to eat here and give our review. And if you ever come here, right next door is Schmidt's Fudge House, which is right here. But we're going to go in here and try it. You get a fun little photo op right here at front. So yeah, uh, this is an authentic German restaurant. Welcome in means welcome. I believe I probably said that wrong, but you walk in here and you can get um, meats to go and all that. So I'm with them. So get their potato salad or their kraut or um, their worst to go and take home and cook yourself. That's at their spicy mustard. Here's a look at their menu. Here's their famous cream puffs. Very cool. They also had banquets and meeting rooms for your parties and your corporate events. They have t-shirts. Alright guys, here is a look at the menu here at Schmidt's. Here's the kids menu. Hot dog, cheeseburgers, nuggets, beverages, and for dessert, ice cream, pudding. And they give you this uh, fun little Schmidt sausage truck that you can color. Here is the regular menu. Here's the desserts. We got their famous cream puff, vanilla chocolate peanut butter fudge, or the flavor of the month, which happens to be butterscotch. Cakes, tarts, pies. The strudel in the front case looked amazing. Starters. They're known for their uh, famous potato soup. Salads. More to offer. They also have uh, catering rooms and food trucks. Let's look all over. Here's a look at their uh, bratwurst menu. They got the sampler, which lets you try all the different types of bratwurst. The sides. So we did end up ordering one of the uh, sausage samplers to share. And we also ordered one of the Haas Saarbraten. So yeah, this little German traditional menu there. They also have drink and dessert menus here. Ich 
have one other menu right here, which uh, is their featured menu. The big one, if you come here on Monday through Friday, you can do all you can eat sausage sampler. And there it is right there. The um, cream puff of the month is the butterscotch cream puff. It is $7. So yeah, we ordered a little bit of that and we will show it to you and give you our review. So here's a look at the kids menu. Here's the hot dog, which they sliced up inside the bun. That's kind of cool. Their homemade applesauce. And Miss Elsa here got a grilled cheese and tomato, also with homemade applesauce. You want to try the applesauce? Cinnamon. With cinnamon, you want to try it? Let's try that applesauce. Is that good applesauce? Oh, can I try it? Uh, Very nice. It's backwards. It's very good. Ah. Try this. Oh, that's good. Good stuff. Good pick, Elsa. Here is a look at the bratwurst sampler. With the applesauce, the sauerkraut. That's pretty good. This is the Hassar Rotten, which is like beef and noodles basically. German version of it. it. Looks really delicious. Potato pancakes look nicely cooked. Green beans and spatzel looks delicious. And then this is the famous Bahama Mama with applesauce and potato pancakes for its side. It's supposed to be the spiciest broth that they have. Um, also, one other cool thing here at this restaurant is that um, the waitresses wear like German authentic clothing, like dresses or I don't want to call them like lederhosen, but you know, because it's not, but like a, you know, German female dress. It's really, really cool. Alright. So first off, I think we're gonna try this applesauce. Here's the applesauce. Mmm. Here's the green beans. Those look mighty delicious. Oh, I didn't get spotzel. I need some spotzel. Here's with the spotzel. Won't focus. Ah. Oh, that's delicious. Yep. That's Elsa's. What do you think of the green beans? There you go. They're very good green beans, aren't they? Here's the red skin potatoes. It's not focusing for some reason. There's something with the red skin potatoes that are not my favorite. You being silly. All right, we're gonna try the Bahama Mama. What do you think about that? Here it is. Ow. It smells good.
That was good. Fine. Oh, it's not spicy at all. It's pretty good. Oh. All right, it's time to show the Hossar Broughton. If I'm even saying that right, I'm probably butchering it like none other. But, all right. Here's the beef. Spots with gravy. It is a very good sausage. It's very dense and very high quality. It is definitely not Johnsonville. It's delicious. And what did you think of the hot sour block? Very good. You little messy still eat. What did you think? Thing. Good. Good. I'm still working. Got more broth to try. So the entrees were pretty good. You could tell it was like authentic German quality good food. Um, we all had a really good time, and we liked the food. I think the Bahama Mama bratwurst was probably the best even though it is supposed to be the spiciest thing that they sell here. Uh, yeah, so we ordered dessert and we'll show you that when it comes up. So here is a look at the apple strudel with ice cream. And uh, it should be warm, let's give it a try. Oh, that's where I parked my car. Is that where I parked my car? That's where I parked my car. Here's a look at the peanut butter cream pot. And there is the chocolate cream pie. Care to dig in to try? Alright, you want to try it, Buggy Boo? Yeah. It's very good. They're cold. So yeah. It's different. How's the cream puff? Very good. But the peanut butter is nice. How's the cream pie? It's delicious. The chocolate is very um, smooth and silky not too chocolate. So here's one last look at a uh, Smith Sausage House. Dinner was delicious. I would highly recommend if you're ever in Columbus, Ohio, stop here and uh, try the bratwurst and one of the cream puffs. So the chocolate peanut butter cream puff was amazing and I got a butterscotch to go. So we're going to try that out. This restaurant has been featured on the travel channels man vs food if you watch episode one and go to columbus you will come here and uh, adam richmond adam richmond made it here and uh he was on the show so they got t-shirts you can buy and all kinds of stuff so and also, if you want to get any of their meats to take home, yeah, just stop in. It was very delicious. <laughs>